so in the last video we have seen um, a query um, of a complete relationship and we have um, tried to execute that query and we had um, graph output in the form of um, an originating node and different destination nodes with all these rela relationships um, uh, associated with the originating node and destination nodes um, so now I would like to be a bit more specific about the pattern and um, uh, we can see uh, these relationships and most of these relationships are enemy off relationships and owns relationships but let's say we are not interested in any of these relationships rather we want to have a specific um, relationship uh, so we, what we want from near from j is that give us um, an output with a similar kind of pattern but we want to be a bit more specific about the relationships in which we are interested uh, so uh, if you can see on the left hand side um, we can see various different kind of labels of uh, relationships uh, which are um, present currently in the Doctor Who database uh, so we have uh, an ally of relationship, an enemy of relationship, which you are seeing over here. We've got played relationship, owns, and so on and so forth. Um, so let's say I'm interested in appeared in relationship. How would I be able to exactly um, highlight that I'm interested in appeared in relationship? Uh, so that New4j takes that pattern and result and returns us. Um, the output uh, which have an originating node and destination node but the relationships are all appeared in relationships so that's very simple very straightforward you uh, basically uh, type appeared in next to the variable and separate the variable um, using a colon sign and that's pretty much what you have to do now if you play this um, query and for some reason we have not been able to this is because uh, this this is typo um, so I think that would match the spelling and I'll try to execute it again and here's uh, the result set um, you can again see that is a, a, an originating node uh, these are different destination nodes and all the relationships uh, I don't know how if you can see it clearly in the video but all these relations let me try to um, zoom it a bit all the relationships now in our output are appeared in relationships so that's a very simple um, case where we want to highlight uh, these labels of relationships or you can say relationship types within the pattern uh, let's just have a quick look at the tabular form of output and we can see that the originating node is pretty much the same in all these outputs um, which is raw styler a character um, and in terms of the destination nodes we can see different kind of output so this is episode 198 with a title journeys end but this has a different title and this is a different episode number so we can see different destination nodes clearly um, the relationship is empty for the same reason because it doesn't have any properties but you can see the relationships over here